with this net learning i want to say a big thank you to so many of you guys who have decided to subscribe to the channel i know it's been a while since i posted my last video it's been about a month now and the way that i want to correct it is to post more video in less time frame and that we are more connected and that we are more engaged tonight what i want to present to you is actually the symbol pi it is in the future that i will be talking about i will be referring to pi so it is only fair that i give you guys a heads up um, of at least define pi so when i'm talking about it that you know you are at least have an idea a clue what i'm talking about well what is pi pi is actually one of the greek letters um it is part of one of the greek letters oftentimes when we think of the greek letters um generally we think of uh beta we think of alpha of other in other popular greek letter but pi actually fell into that category of being one of greek letters um, well, oftentimes when we think of pi, we say that pi is the equivalent of 3.14. But when we think of pi of having uh, an arc measure, this is an arc measure of 3.14. What else when we think of pi of having, um, um, it's also we think of pi of having um, an angle measure of 100 degree when we talk about pi radian. Um, so this would be the basic definition of pi. Um, definitely do like this channel, do subscribe to the channel and go ahead and like this video. And, um, again, I want to thank all of you guys who have decided, who have become, have decided to become part of the YouTube community of Math Wizard with Descent Learning. Um, thank you guys and have a wonderful night. Thank you.